Pickers, we are here again. And we bought two storage units. Again. <laughs> we always seem to buy them in pairs, don't we? That's fun. I like it. We got the old truck. Love taking out the old truck. She does not get enough miles on her. So this one is down here. And you're going to see right away what made me buy this. Bow, 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 bow. The Ghostbusters. Bow, 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 bow. The Ghostbusters. Can't go wrong with Ghostbusters. We paid 170 bucks, really, for six boxes and a tote. Would you have done that? Did I do the wrong thing? I know you guys like watching me uh, buy storage units, so that's what I'm gonna keep doing. What's up, pickers? How are you doing? We got a new storage unit and we're gonna go through it. Let's do it. Before we do that, let me grab a do-rag. Two hats, a new bag, and fiddle with this doodad. We buy storages, loving them fresh oranges. Some of the best, sexiest hair since Zach Morris's. So saddle up and take a ride with me. We find a treasure today, a pickers warehouse TV. This one should be pretty quick. We can, uh... It's gonna be kind of dark in there, so maybe we'll do a tailgate unboxing. What do you guys think? Bring the boxes out and do a tailgate unboxing just so we get some good light. Hopefully there's something in there. I don't know. That quick glance, I didn't see anything that looked great other than the, the cool poster. But uh, yeah, let me get this camera set up and we will begin unboxing right now. All right, first box and it's a big one. Looks like we got a, some kind of cool little art bag. Nice little beach bag. There's something in there. Is this the bag within a bag? Oh, it's phone chargers. Okay, phone chargers. What about this little purse? It's kind of cute, right? It's got another purse in it. Polygrip. You gotta get them things to stick, right? Oatmeal cookie. There's a drawing, some toothpicks, book of spells. So that's a, another purse. A purse within a purse within a purse. The pair of shoes, some boots, Doc Martens. So those are good. Doc Martens, can't go wrong with that. Hey, a thingy. Crystals and rocks and stuff. That's super cool. I like that. I have to say it's really well packed. Looks pretty clean. Let's see what we got. This looks like books. Oh boy, look at this. Inner Witch. It's all like spiritual books. Gods and heroes. Ooh, look, Star Wars. Stevie Nicks. Star Wars. There's a comic book. There's a couple comic books. Look at that. Awesome Marilyn Monroe Cup. So maybe we'll find some comic books if they were into that. But it looks like a lot of kind of spiritual books. All right, let's jump into the next one. Oh, cool. Look at that. Can you guys see that? I know the camera angle is not great. We got a poster. Let's start with the poster. It is signed artwork, it looks like. Yep, signed artwork. This is kind of a neat box. We got a record. Sometimes the weird stuff is good. So there's a record. Here's another record. Looks like it's autographed by the band. So that might be something. Ooh, look. Dungeons and Dragons Essentials Kit. That's cool. Little baby uh, Dungeons and Dragons figures. That's awesome. We got a laptop. We have a laptop. A Dell. That's better than a Frank or a Bob, isn't it? And then we got a pop figure of Hisoka. I don't know who that is. You guys know who that is? Drop it in the comments what that's from. Here's a bag. And the bag has got just kind of makeup. Makeup style stuff. There's other books. Big old thing of papers. Some more original art. Let's see what this is. Ooh, fancy chopsticks. That's kind of neat. It's important to note that it's about 100 degrees out. Very, very hot. This one is taped up really well. 
Maybe this will be our jackpot box. Come on, jackpot box. Come on, jackpot box. Oh my god, my favorite box. You know I love these boxes. Kitchen, there's actually other stuff under there. We've got a nice big uh, Remington Pro. And it's in there, you can tell by the weight. Yep, it's in there, it looks clean. Very, very cool. <laughs> you know, I be blow drying often. Not really, I like to just air dry to be honest with you, but. Interesting. Okay, let's see what else. This looks like the, the one that would have jewelry if there was jewelry, doesn't it? I don't know what that is. Books on tape, I guess. A couple of bottles. That is jewelry, but I don't know if it's precious metals. Ooh, look at all the beautiful rocks. You guys seeing that? We love rocks. And there's a whole beautiful thing of them. We'll probably put those on auction. And then these are cold. That's kind of cool. Then you got some more tarot cards. Old school Polaroid. That's awesome. And then different astrology books, alchemy. Yeah, you know, just different little neat things. All right, not bad. Kind of a neat box. Oh, and look at the greatest score a guy can find. Free stamps. Pickers, I don't know if this next box is supposed to be upside down, but this is how they had it in there. So either it's upside down or it's not. We're about to find out right now. If all the stuff is upside down, let's see what we got. Oh boy. Oh boy. Kitchen stuff. It's a nice, a nice clean crock pot. We're not even gonna spend time looking at this. There's a crock pot down there. Kitchen stuff, not my favorite stuff. All right, next box, Liliana. I don't know that brand. Some, some sexy shoes. Some interesting shoes there. And then we got a tote, which looks like it's gonna be not only this egg, but probably, that's kind of different. Some little neat trinkets and stuff. Mostly school artwork, it looks like. Tommy Hilfiger. That's pretty much all that was in this bag. I thought this was a paper bag, but it's a leather type bag. Reusable, I guess. Not my style of unit, guys, right? Next box is... Shirts. If that's old, that's good. Looks like it could be older. Not quite sure on that one. And then a bunch of women's clothes. It looks like nice enough stuff though. You know, you got what looks like name brands. This is gonna be, wow, hold on. This is gonna be worth going through. Let's just do it. I got another box here. I'll throw stuff into, so clothing, clothing, clothing. But there's t-shirts and I'm hoping they're older t-shirts. You know, this is all, all clothing. I'm not sure about that, but I saw older t-shirts at the bottom. At this point, I'm really just trying to get to those. It's like nice stuff. We can donate all of this. But I saw possible neat stuff. Inuyasha. I don't know if that's dirty or if that's how the shirt was made. And I don't know if I'm saying that right. Okay. Let's go a little bit quicker so we can get to the meat and potatoes that I saw at the bottom here. Look at that. Nike. Warriors. That's real nice. It's a jacket. That's a really nice jacket. And the Warriors are hot, hot, hot right now. It's a little bit beat up over here. Oh, those might just be fuzzies. So that's a cool piece. Avatar, Boys in the Hood. I think these are just all reprints. 
Tupac. Is that the whole shirt? That's a heavy duty shirt. And there's something in it. Let's see, there's a bunch of those, look. So maybe some, there could be something good in here. You really gotta check it out to see if it's older or not. That's pretty, oh, nope, there's a whole bunch more. <laughs> you gotta love the t-shirt t-shirts. Oakland A's, a lot of uh, anime stuff. So this could be good. That might be the biscuit in this one. Oh, there's even more, dude, look. The t-shirts, the graphic tees, just keep going and going and going. Little Oakland A's jersey, that's cool. Man, the clothes box is it's kind of the coolest box. When you really start digging, we're coming up on jerseys and sweaters and sports stuff and hip hop. Now that's an older shirt. Let's see. Double stitch, but it's got a regular tag. That might be a little bit older of a Tupac biscuit. Definitely some neat stuff. Let me go grab the other piece. All right, so the last box had some baby stuff some camping stuff and some Christmas stuff. But the whole reason we bought this unit, which turned out to be kind of a dud, was this, this old poster. It says 84, 85, so I have to see if that's original. Let's set it down and take a look. But it's neat, right? That was a, for me, that was $175. Ghostbusters poster, so I will enjoy it. I will treasure it for years to come. All right, guys, till the next one. Like I said, there's some value here. It's really hard to lose on a unit when you go through and sell everything. Look up all the little things you found, but not super fun. That's okay, that's how it goes sometimes. That's why they call it a gamble. So, Ghostbusters, you're my best friend in this unit. Mm. And that's how the cookie crumbles, guys. Love you very much. Until the next one, we'll see you here on Pickers Warehouse TV. Whee!
resort 